Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Tales of Destiny. Well, let's go ahead and open up this uh, door with the three keyholes. The door is opened after you use the uh, bronze key, iron key, and gold key. And it seems to have uh, lit everything up as well. Ooh. That's pretty. There are three keyholes. You inserted the bronze key, iron key, and gold key into the keyholes. There's some strange looking machinery here. All right. Why the uh, the rats that were not rats that were actually um, enemies had them? I don't know. Let's go into the other uh, the destroyed warp gate. All right. So here is where we like. I'm just gonna go down and take a look at uh, what these places actually look like. Hold on. Make sure that I didn't miss anything. There's definitely a chance that I might have missed something. Zip on back out of here. Oops. And all the way over here. But yeah, why those, uh, why they looked like rats and why they turned into other things? Like, they really should have had rat like monsters there rather than just generic robot enemies that we've been fighting. Or they should have made them look like robot enemies. Like, what were they? And there's nothing there. Hold on, why am I getting an alert on my phone? Okay, that's nothing I need to worry about. There. Okay. Can't interact with that. We got the items here. And there's nothing down here, right? No. All right. All right. That door opens up now, so that's good. Nothing there. All right. That's just going back up to the uh, the big room. All right. Well. And teleport just to make sure that that is working. Okay. All right. Uh, let's see. So it looks like we need to go down and to the. I really do wish we had a, a map, and it's kind of weird that. Oh. Retreat. I don't want to fight one of those. I don't mind fighting the other things, but not the impulse. I hate those things so freaking much. There's nothing there. Ah, it looks like that's where we're going. All right. Another impulse? Come on! Let's get out of here. Ooh, it's a green one. I like green. I forgot that you could retreat through the uh, the retreat thing. I thought initially I thought when I first saw it it was like s like stay away from the enemy and and either let me handle it or uh, oh it's overgrown okay like let me handle it or or do things from a distance or something. Oh. 
Interesting. This looks pretty neat. Hi, monsters. At least it's prettier than the other ones that we've been at. I like green. I say. Pretty easy enemies, though, because uh, we've encountered them before. Still giving uh, 1,000 XP, though. It's nothing to uh, sneeze at. Uh, Crespo. Crescent bow, lens encrusted longbow. Its appearance uh, brings to mind a crescent moon. Slightly better. Way less hit, though. Although I don't know what hit does. So. Given that, given that big difference, I think I'll, I'll stick with the uh, hit, though. The goddess who shines her light upon darkness bides her time silently. Oh, Alara and Arachnid, huh? Let's go with the Flare Tornado. That is an ugly looking creature. There we go. Got a palm seed. So I should probably use more miracle gels. New spell. Uh, whirlwind creates a whirlwind around uh, the enemy. Okay, no idea if there is uh, anything else to do in there. All right. that there is, uh... Okay, yeah, there's nothing to uh, do there. Right, wrong button. Some of the, uh, the wrong button is literally rem misremembering what button does what. Other times it's just my hand is in a different position and I hit the wrong button. Which is what that was. I got a squid! Might be close to max on squids. We got level ups for uh, Philia and Gar, or Clemente and uh, Tenos. Yeah, max out on squids. Let's go ahead and put it in the food, sa food sack. It is uh, not exactly worth much at all. Um. Up we go to level two. So I'm not sure if the uh, the Demon Seal helps people who are not in the current party, but I will definitely put that on Chelsea once Gar catches up. The fragment of the Knight's first star falls in the west. All right, we had a crescent before. Now we got three stars. Got a Luki blade. A, a strange sword that improves the luck of its owner. Not very good. Honestly. Uh, 
Bloody Rose. Got up to nine hits there. Got some vegetables. Right, I should actually try that on another level up. Enemies that we can actually see it happen on. I got distracted. All right, uh, let's see. We have a couple different ways to go, but I want to know which one matters. Go to this one over here first. There are some missable items in here. damage output is pretty great. It's pretty nice. Okay, up we go. Let's hit up this teleporter. I'm hoping that it leads to an item. I think it does. And another uh, pedestal. Will it be something about uh, Ozymandias? Fruity, a bloody rose. Strong hammer, ow! Rude. Got a six hit combo. No item, though. The Fire Spirit, the source of all light, faces the goddess and burns when it receives the light of fire. So there's the uh, sun. Uh, is there something... Let's see. Okay, no, there's no item here. Alright. So that is uh, fine. Missing my teleporter. Get back down. Now we want to go to the leftmost. The rightmost doesn't matter. Or the middle one. We, we came up the rightmost. The middle one doesn't matter. I wonder if anyone is actually going to get this one. If not, I'm seriously tempted to keep this on someone. Because Demon's Lance is pretty good. Down we go. Bypass that one. Get into another fight. Those things. Ah, I didn't get it. Ow. Excuse me. Rude. There we go. Get dead. Or destroyed, as the case may be. Shatter that crystal. Alright, from here. All the way over here, and up here. So, Gar can't use his special attacks, but he can use the spells, so that's... 
Interesting. I wasn't expecting that. Those level ups are getting uh, further apart, unfortunately. But uh, Nintendo's is up to level 20 now, so I mean that's it's pretty good. Let's take this one. Ooh, goodies. Uh, P ring, uh, GC rod, and an Elven cape. Now, I know an Elven cape is something that can grow from one of the various uh, things. Uh, protect ring. Ring engraved with an image of a war god reduces effects of enemies' physical attacks by 10%. So that feels like a like equivalent of a, a flat 10% damage reduction. That's pretty good. Greenish cape increases enemy avoidance by 10%. And GC rod, green crystal rod, a holy item from the legend of Ishtar. You can actually use it as a weapon. Attack 1, defense 10, hit 10, wind. But we need this for a bonus dungeon. Uh, let's see. I want the rabbit's foot. So, avoidance goes up, evade goes up by 16. I don't know how that's 10%. Unless it's doing some other calculation. Both of those are good. So, big drop in defense, but it... Ah, uh, hmm see if there's a recommendation on that, because, uh... Yeah. I don't know, I, I feel like th at this point, 40 defense is probably better than 10% reduction in physical attacks, because most of the enemies don't do a whole lot of damage with physical attacks. It feels like. That might be very good for certain bosses or something like that, but I don't think that it is really all that. Bloody Rose! Ah, dang it. Is that gonna hit me? Yep. 666 damage. Rude. First aid on Felia. Interesting. Squid and an orange gel. Is that an orange gel that wasted? I think so. Ah, it's fine. But the uh, squid, I will use. Let's well get some use out of it. Saturn stands between the Fire Spirit and the Goddess. Oh, Orse, huh? Dang it! Ah, oh, and it hit everyone. Rude. A lot of XP and gold. Eight hits. Still up 20. All right, there's a the symbol of Saturn. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any treasure in here.
Another level up, I think, for Antenos. Okay, we're at 2,000 lands, which is fine. Uh, there is nothing on the right, so up we go. And first thing, let's go to this one. Alright, this seems like something I can't do anything with yet. Evil Eye. Okay, Stone Press. Womp. Just drop that uh, that rock down. Light spear. Oh no, that's uh, that's mine. I was forgetting that's what uh, that attack is. Only two hits, unfortunately. All right, let's uh, take the other one. Dude, stop interrupting my attacks. Flare Tornado seems more like an eruption than flare tornado <laughs> to me, but what do I know, right? What do I know? Alright, what do, ooh, hello. Hmm. Maybe I want to go the other way. Seven hit. Yeah, look, she keeps getting more hits on there, too. Like, if that enemy hadn't died, then uh, she would have gotten even more hits. It's really good for hit combos. So, new spell for Gar Air Slash. Savagely lacerates enemies with air. Alright. Use that against enemies. Um. 28 for uh, next level. Words are engraved on the monument. A crimson cyclone of flame, born of the earth, shall rise into the skies. What is its name? Flare tornado, fear flare, firestorm, firewall. I'm guessing flare tornado, but let me take a look. Um... Yes, Flare Tornado. Right. The sword shall roar with the force of an untamed beast. What is its name? All right, well, that's force. An explosion that ravages the soul like a scream from the netherworld. Old mastered the sacred skill, Hellfire. the enemy together with force and burns them with bursts of lava. Well, let's try that. Alright, let's see. Um... Okay. Now I want to look at the... Uh... Alright, so it doesn't tell me to go to the other room. So I guess I don't have uh, anything to do there. Up the stairs we go. There's a save point. Might as well make use of it. So that 
push any of these. Okay. I'm gonna bring you here. Looks like moon, that looks like sun. Is that Saturn? Um, hmm. We got some doors here. Are they locked? No, they're not. Is this good? Well, first, got tornado. Or a disc engraved with the image of wind. Is slightly better thrust, but very slightly. It's a lot better than what she's using, a little bit less defense, but also, well, let's go ahead and see what it is. The one that she was using doesn't actually give uh, spells that I care about on her all that much. Just Cyclone, and she already has Cyclone, so... Yeah, no. She does not need physical damage, anyway. Uh, what did you have? Here. There we go. So we got some holes here. Drop that down. Oops. Hmm. All right. I uh, did that one wrong. Did that in the wrong place. Okay, well, it is about time to uh, end the episode. Um, so I'm going to load back up. We'll go get that chest uh, real fast. And um, when we come back, we'll see if we can figure out what this uh, puzzle is. We, we have the clues. Um, there's something about the... Uh, the Tears of the Star falling in the west or something. I don't know if there's a way to reset it. I think, I suspect, that this comes over here. Makes Saturn. Yeah. So that makes Saturn. That's what I figured. And then we just need to, like, figure out where everything else needs to go. But uh, that will be for next time. See you then, everyone.